another video sponsored by VHT Inc. We're standing right outside our Cedar Creek. I'm not sure if y'all saw the other video from the other Cedar Creek we posted. This one's actually really nice. It's a champagne edition. Y'all need to check this one out. Model, ne model number 38 LE EL. So check it out if y'all want to look it up. This one does have different dimensions inside of it, but it does have similar layout of the other one we uploaded, uh, I want to say like a few months back. If y'all want to check it out, this is the model number, like I said, 38EL. Come on inside, you got to check it out from the inside. So this has a similar layout to our other Cedar Creek that we had, also with the Cameo we uploaded on there as well. It's basically the same thing. It has two slides from one side, one from the other. Only difference is it does have a few other details added to it. Like for example, this chandelier here, it's really nice. It has designs on it and it basically gives it a dimension uh, rather than just being a simple light pointing down, it has all of those cool dimensions. Along with like right in the back, you can see it does have these spots here where you're able to lower it for your blackout, blackout curtains. These are actually really nice. Uh, but it does have that dimension as well on the top. You have all of these couches here, which is pretty cool. They're reclinable. It's kind of like a suede, uh, suede couch on both sides. So those are pretty cool. It's nice color. It gives it a good touch to, for the rest of the RV itself because of the color itself. Uh, right over here, you have the entertainment center. You have a sound bar. You have a fireplace. And then you have the TV right up here with some accent lights at the bottom these are your accent lights right here and then same thing inside there you have the accent lights as well i thought that was actually pretty cool right behind me you enter the kitchen which i thought was nice it has this little spot here for a cooler a bottle cooler which i thought was pretty cool as well uh, i believe this one does come with that model it has a wine rack right next to it and then we have some storage right up here with very big drawers which is pretty convenient um all of this is actually considered a uh, stock so this comes from factory this isn't uh something that was added to it it actually comes like that uh right behind me this is something that's pretty cool i thought uh the stove is electrical this isn't actually a gas which is the first one that i've seen um some of our videos you'll be able to see all of them are, are going to be gas powered and then you have the microwave right over here which is actually really big uh compared to the others because it doesn't have an oven so it has to replace for the oven as well and then right behind me you have the fridge the fridge is super big as well it has the three door fridge uh from both sides and then you have the freezer at the bottom which is pretty convenient uh right behind me we have some more storage space you have these uh cabinets right up here with all that storage up there and then right here on the side along with this side here all of this is actually pretty cool it's like a little pantry that you have um along with some storage at the bottom one thing i did forget to mention is this does have a dishwasher right on the island on the side here if you want to come around uh it does have a dishwasher down here so i thought that was pretty cool uh you can see that it does have some led lights at the bottom of the uh, of the island as well and i thought that was pretty cool as well the the island is a little bit separated from everything else you have the dining room right here which gives you the space to walk around you have this counter space right here which is actually pretty cool and then you have some control panels right here. Uh, these control panels are for the AC. It has the same thing, zone one, zone two. Um, not all of them carry that, but this one does have two AC, so it needs that. Right over here is the other control panel, which is gonna be for your lights, um, your slides. Your slides are hydraulic, so it's only a single a single button for your slide. And then you have some of, of the lights right here, which is for your fan. This is for the water heater. Uh, it does have kind of like an instant water heater, so this is a bypass water heater. Uh, once the water runs through, it'll heat it up and then you're able to control it from here along with some fans um, and then your leveling jacks right here. I thought that was actually nice. Not all of them carry controls for your leveling. Right in here is the bathroom. This bathroom is actually like the other Cedar Creek we had before. It has the double sinks, the accent, accent light at the bottom, some drawers at the bottom. You have him and her uh, basically uh, sinks as well with all this storage on the side so that way you are able to have uh, some space to store um, the lights right up here give it all that lighting you need in general it has some natural lighting as well with the fan uh, right up there and then on the side here you'll be able to see that we have the walk-in shower which is actually pretty cool on five six like I had mentioned before and it's actually pretty tall uh, some of them are reduced in space but this one is nice and you have all the space to move around you have the sliding doors as well which is pretty cool and it doesn't feel so crowded in here it feels pretty spacious uh, to be able to move around and not feel like you're crowded. I thought that was pretty cool. Right over here 
to be able to see that we have the bedroom this is the main bedroom one of the things i like about this bedroom is that right behind me you'll be able to see it has a closet this is actually kind of like a walk-in closet sort of which has all of that space you have your washer and dryer connection right there on the right side which is pretty convenient and you have a bunch of space to be able to store it you have the accent light at the bottom there which gives it that pretty cool look on top of the fact that it has pretty good lighting in here so i thought that was pretty cool that was one of my favorite parts about this uh this bedroom itself and then right behind here, you see that we have a bunch of uh, drawers as well, drawers that you can uh, store anything in. And then right here, it's a little compartment, which you can store some stuff there. I thought that was pretty cool as well. You have all these accent lights at the bottom. This one actually has a bunch of accent lights, which gives it that nice dimension. And then back here, this headboard as well is actually pretty cool. It gives it that nice dimension with these uh, reading lights as well. And then you have a mirror right here, just in case if you needed more mirrors. There's another mirror right here. Uh, but this is actually spacious compared to others that we've seen. Uh, I, I do believe that one is gonna be a king size bed. Not all of them have a king size bed addition. So like that is a queen size, but you can adjust it to a king size. You have the ability to do either or, which on the model, if you look it up, it says that. Um, one of the cool things about this, I actually like this uh, lighting up here. I thought that was pretty cool. It kind of looks like a chandelier type, uh, but it's actually a glass with a bunch of lights in it. And uh, it has like LED lights inside there uh kind of looks like a disco ball some somewhat so i thought that was pretty cool as well but i wanted to show you all this video i'm not sure if you've seen the one previous before this one that one's really nice as well it's a three bedroom um there's a few of them that are going to be coming we had a monte carlo that was coming like i had mentioned on the other video i thought i'd show you this one first before we do the other one it hasn't arrived yet but it will be receiving uh i think within the next week we'll probably get it uh, if you want to check it out, we have our website, we have our Instagram. We do get a bunch of pictures, videos that we've been uploading lately. Check them out. Our inventory is pretty wide. At the start of the video, I'm not sure if you saw all those uh, RVs in the back. That's actually our dealership. Check them out. We have pictures and descriptions of everything on our website. And we have uh, some prices on there as well. We kind of don't, don't keep the prices away from you. We show you what we are actually working with. And they're all used. Check them out. Let, let us know what you think and if you have any comments you can also contact me my name is Jose and I have my, my phone number somewhere I think it's up here as well if y'all want to contact me and you need more uh, questions regarding anything feel free to do so it was a pleasure seeing you again